Hi Taurus, welcome to your weekly reading for May 17th to the 23rd, 2019. All right, let's see what you guys have going on. So first of all, in your what card, you have the person voyage in the earth position. So the first thing I think is this, this always means being brought back to earth for me. Um, it can mean some type of misfortune, um, some kind of loss, troubled relationships, um, difficulty. This is like the world card, so it's a cycle that is, you're, you're trying to turn it, you're trying to get it in the upright position, but you're stuck. So something has made you stuck, something not moving forward. This can also mean that you don't know what your objective is. Like it's kind of hazy, you know, like what do I want? Um, so you can't push it forward until you figure out where you want to go. Um, in the how, you have the seven of coins in the upright, and this is called money. This is getting money that's owed to you um, or money that you've invested, and it's, it's something, um, it's not new money that you're making. It's money that was owed to you from before. This can also refer to starting something like some kind of large scale financial venture, um, taking a risk, thinking about it, something new, um, thinking of a new direction. So that could be what this is referring to, that this is something new that you're trying to do, or maybe you're trying to get money for, get paid for something. Um, you can't get it going, it's not happening. This can also be related in that this is kind of wondering, what do I really want? And this is wondering about a venture and wondering, is it really worth it? And then in the Y, you have the Two of Swords in the upright. This is called friendship. This is about family harmony, workplace harmony, um, returning favors, like give and take, like just, you know, friends just, you know, being nice. Um, also, um, discussion, exchanging ideas. Could be waiting for someone's response. This can also mean that you've met somebody new that you're interested in. Could be work or relationship. And how you're going to feel. You have the six of coins in the upright. This is hmm, feeling confused, but comfortably confused. You could be enjoying yourself or you want to. You're ready to, you're ready to, you're ready to move on and start something new with maybe somebody new. You're talking to somebody about something. Lots of coins here. Um, I'm I'm picking up that yeah, you're ready to you're ready to start something new, maybe with somebody new, and you want to go out, like you want to do stuff, like eating, drinking, like just having fun, like dating, socializing. Um, this can mean not just one person, but like um, like lots of people. This is really about sharing the joy, like um, like socializing, having people over, entertaining. You feel healthy, you feel like you have enough. This is very much about assets and asset division as well. So this could be like a divorce your, um, or severance. You're ready to start celebrating anyway. You're ready to collect and start celebrating maybe with new friends this that's could be what this is as well like talking exchanging ideas mm, in your advice you have the knight of swords in the upright this is called military this is someone who is possibly um ready to fight for something ready to make a point intelligent compassionate this isn't an attacking military card this is uh it's actually the opposite it can also be someone that attacks injustice this is a very just card direct using your logic at the bottom of the deck you have the fortune and the upright this um suggests luck that you're going to be lucky this can mean holidays you're going on um holidays making profits making money so that's nice 
to, um, this is, you have two cards saying you're, you're going to cash in here. Um, also, this is about good luck and vitality, good opportunities, something destined. They're looking at each other. Where these two meet, this is having anxiety, worried. Maybe you're worried about fighting for something, fighting for your money. Can also be worried about something new start, something new that started. And then where these are meeting, this is a false friend, this is frustration, and this is also impasse in negotiations. So I think having this fortune card below the impasse is saying if you are having trouble turning this world around and you're trying to get paid for something, this is saying you're going to get it, but it's also saying you're going to have to fight for it using logic, using very clear communication. That's how I'm seeing it, Taurus. So let me just run through this again. So yeah, you're trying to you're trying to turn a cycle, you're trying to start a new a new part of your life. You're trying to close out the old, and that could mean financial as well, or you're trying to start some kind of new venture like buying a house, starting a business, something um, something involving um, quite a bit of money maybe. This could mean someone coming to an agreement and because this is all about give and take and this is also about give and take. This can be about asset division. So it, it looks like you're settling something, Taurus, and you're gonna have to be very clear but it's gonna happen. That's how I'm seeing it. And your shuffle song was called Hypnotic by Zelda Day. All right, love you guys. I hope you have a great week. Bye.